Good afternoon. Well, good afternoon. Thank you for coming in today. We appreciate it very much. Well, thank you. Tell us a little bit about, not necessarily the necklace, but the pendant itself. Well, it was sort of an unusual find. Yes, ma'am. An unusual find. Okay, how so? And uh, that it came in something at an auction that was, we didn't know it was in there. Oh, we so were, really wanted something else. Well, and that's this fun. was yeah. right there. So it was in the bottom of the box, kind of? Yes. So how long have you had it? 20 years, probably. Do you wear it a lot? I do wear it a lot. And you enjoy it, I can tell. I do. It's one of my favorites. Well, I have to tell you, you know, sometimes it's, it's not about the picture, it's about the frame. Yeah. In this instance, using a shell, which, you know, to me, jewelry can be about love. And someone had a lot of love involved in this. Either they liked the shell or they had a special time on the water or with a ship. And what they did was they took the shell and they took kind of the bowl of a spoon to make the backing for this and then made rivets through it to the front so that the ship itself is made out of white gold and yellow gold. And it's all been done by hand so it fits perfectly into the shell. So when you have something that nature made in terms of the shell itself and then man came along, made the back and made the ship, it just adds more to it. So, you know, it is one of a kind. And in well, that respect, you. you can say maybe it doesn't have a price, but if we we're going to sit down to try to make something like it, you know, you'd have to go in for at least fifteen hundred or two thousand dollars. Oh my goodness! To make something like that, that beautiful today, but the fact that you wear it, enjoy it every day is the best part. I do enjoy it. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs>